The February-March issue of the Catholic Mirror will show how contributions to the diocese's annual Catholic Appeal help some of the more than 35 agencies, programs, and ministries receiving funds bring positive changes to the lives of our neighbors in need. This issue features the New Spirit Teen Retreat programs that feed the hunger for faith in our young Catholics, and the Church Outreach to Youth program in North Adams that provides a safe haven for 20 to 30 Berkshire County children each weekday. Readers will learn how donations make the sacraments possible for disabled children through the Bureau for Exceptional Children and Adults at Jericho, and how immigrants and neighborhood children are nourished with education, social support, and family-style meals at the Gray House in Springfield. Special features will reveal how the Residence and Counter Christ program in the Berkshire County Jail helped one woman experience the unconditional love of Christ for the first time, and how support for Latino ministry has made this the fastest growing group of active Catholics in the diocese. In addition to the annual appeal stories, readers also will discover the joy of Jesuit father James Martin and the first column in an exciting new series on the Bible, authored by one of our newest diocesan priests, Father Tucker Cordani. While I sometimes feel that my own modest contribution to the annual appeal might not matter, I focus on the advice of Mother Teresa. If you can't feed a hundred people, feed just one. In the end, it all adds up to one big prayer of thanks for the gift of Christ's love in all of our lives. At the editor's desk, I'm Rebecca Drake.